Welcome back to my channel and thank you for making it take your time to listen. Making it take your time to listen. We all know time will tell. What better person who can share that with you but Candace Owens in her own words, anti-Semi versus racism. A victimhood has become almost a mental plague upon black America in particular because that word racism is being so overused that society is becoming desensitized to it and we actually can't even recognize it when it actually exists. We think everything is racist evil that was not started did not begin in Europe actually can actually uh, be traced back to Muslim origins and for whatever reason people have this fantastical rendition of history where they think that it was only white people that ever did anything bad when in fact the truth is that even in terms of our own history American history it was the Africans that were selling the Africans to the European. Marie, by the way, it was white men that were the first in the world to abolish the slave trade. So I read this article, and honestly, there are only two options here. Either this rabbi is genuinely ignorant of everything that I have ever said, in which case I'm happy to clarify it because he will be joining us on today's episode, or the other option is he's completely aware of things that I have said, and he is just a monster. Candace Owens is a Jew-hating bigot. Yeah, so I am the ultimate defender of free speech, and I believe that we need more speech, not less of it. When we see things, we believe that not to, believe, to be true. Rather than censoring that individual, we should actually give that person a platform because people will walk away and be able to assess whether or not the statements they heard was true. I have called you, and I'm not alone, because many Jews have called you an anti-Semite. Mm -hmm. Also, talk people who say you have a really sweetheart, just so you know. You and I have a number of mutual friends. 